The Enologue rendezvoused with the observation planes over Iwo Jima at 0605. Little boy was armed at 0730. At 0741, Tibbets began the climb to the drop altitude above 30,000 feet. The Enologue came within sight of the Empire, as bombing crews called it, at 0750, as it approached the southern tip of Shikoku Island. The weather plane over the primary target radioed good conditions at 0830, and Tibbets announced that Hiroshima would be their destination. At 0909, Hiroshima came into view. At 091330, the bombardier Thomas Farabee took control of the plane in preparation for release. At 091417, the OA bridge appeared in the Norton bombsite crosshairs, and Farabee initiated the automatic release sequence. At 091517, Little boy dropped away. The fall to the burst altitude of 600 meters lasted 43 seconds. At that moment, little boy had a vertical velocity of 335 meters per second, just a bit faster than sound. As soon as the bomb was released, Tibbets took control, and the Enola Gay began its escape maneuver. Eleven and a half miles from the detonation point and nearly a minute after the explosion, the plane was rocked by the shock wave traveling directly from the fireball, and then several seconds later it was struck by a second weaker shock reflected from the ground. Aside from the sighting of a single fighter, the flight back from the mission was uneventful. The mushroom cloud, which had climbed to 40,000 feet, was visible from the plane for almost an hour and a half, finally being lost from sight at 1041. 363 miles from Hiroshima. At 1458 hours, after a textbook perfect mission lasting 12 hours and 13 minutes, the Enola Gay landed at Tinian Island.